morning <clears throat> excuse me <clears throat> excuse me good morning everybody it's me fatima all the way from the gambia getting up this morning going out for my morning walk happy sabbath to everybody you all know that if i pause my video it's because people were work walking by and you know i try not to record anyone and you know if i pause it again and there's children around. You know, I'm not going to try to record the children. As beautiful as they are, don't want to record the children. I hope everybody's doing well. I did come down this road before, didn't I? Okay, well, I want to come by, tell everyone about... I had a rough day the other day. I had a rough day. But, you know, I want to tell you all about it. And even here... In Gambia, we, you, you're going to have some good days, you're going to have some bad days. But before I start, you all, if you're not a subscriber, go ahead and click the subscribe button. And also click the notification button. So that way you can be notified of any of my videos that I have coming out. Oh my gosh, it's been some rough days, y'all. So let me tell you about one of my rough days. So the other day, you know, sometimes during some storms and stuff like that, the electricity goes out. And whether you're in a commercial business or at home, home business, you got to deal with the commercial, I mean, with the electricity going out. So anyway, y'all, you know, I'm on somebody's land, so let me be careful with this. So anyway... Um, the other day, um, on Friday, when I left my store, the electricity, I'm going to call it a, no a notification alert, went off after I left the store. So, it beeps. What it is, it's a beep. All it does is just beep. Just beep, 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 and it'll beep all the way till the meter is at zero. And when the meter gets to zero, lights out, period. So it beeped for a long time. I guess for the whole weekend. And then after a while, it just said lights out. And by the time I came back to work on Tuesday, because Monday we had a little bit of um, um, issues with the rain, after it beeped on Tuesday, huh, lights went out. And my refrigerator, all the meat... Well, the refrigerator stopped working, of course, so everything thawed out. My burgers, my Philly steaks, my chicken, everything thawed out. Oh, my gosh. I came to work, and it was just, yeah. Had a bad day, y'all. All right, y'all. Take a look at this video. Tell me what you think. Okay, so you just you Wait, just you smelt doing? you just smelt the thing. I'm not taking pictures of y'all. So the the filling meat is not good. Okay, so it's not good. Nope. We'll just start all over again. It's the filling meat. So it's not good. It's not good. I don't know. Uh, uh, okay. So we had to throw away all our meat. See, it's starting to turn. And I am not serving that to any customers. So we'll start, start from scratch again. Unfortunately, we'll just start, as they say, small, small. All we can do is start with one pack at a time. Dang. All right, at least we have, do we have chicken at least? That we can serve chicken? We can at least serve the barbecue chicken and chicken wings, right? Okay. All right, so we'll hold off on the hamburgers and the fillies. Dang. All right, we're back. All right, y'all, tell me what you think, I know. A few little bit of rotten meat shouldn't stop anything. I know. 
But it's just the fact that I had to go and buy a whole new thing of meat, pull money out of my account to go um to buy some more meat. Uh, I had to buy meat, fish, lettuce, tomatoes, onions. But like I said, I will not complain. It's just part of doing business. So you're going to have some days here where the electricity may go out and it may ruin a few things. And then you have to start all over by purchasing it. Purchasing your stuff. Hold guys. Okay. Sorry about that, y'all. So yeah, I had to go purchase a whole bunch of meat. Start making my fillies from scratch again. Uh, my burgers. Uh, cheeseburgers and all that uh, I had to go buy a whole new thing of chicken because I you know like I said I do chicken wraps buffalo style chicken ranch barbecue now chicken wraps and um chicken strips I'm gonna start making some honey mustard so I could just have a chicken chicken strip meal something like that so yeah I had to do it all over but you know the blessing that came at the end of the week after I probably whined and moaned about it to my father, <laughs> my heavenly father, he blessed me at the end of the week because um, the week ended pretty good because I sold a lot. I did pretty good Thursday and Friday. I did okay. So it almost replaced everything. I'm so thankful to Father Yah for that. So thankful to my heavenly father. So... That's what I'm saying. I can't complain. Okay. Y'all, let me look at my surroundings. Where am I? Okay, y'all. Let me go straight. So, yeah. It was a rough day. But, ended up being a good ending to the week. Hold up some beautiful tiles. Look at that, y'all. That's some beautiful tiles. That's some beautiful tiles. Okay, so just to let you all know, I am going to start my consulting um, soon. It's going to be on my website, theafricanconnect.com. The link will be there on the website, theafricanconnect.com or uh, .info, either one. And, um, if you're thinking about moving to Africa, thinking about moving to the Gambia, reach out to me through the AfricanConnect.com and you'll see a tag on the left hand side. I'm working on it so the tag will be there soon or the banner will be there soon. But you'll see it on the left hand side once you sign in and register. It'll say the uh, consulting, you know, if you're thinking about moving to Gambia. There's some things you need to know. I'm not going to lie about it. Y'all, there's some things we need to know before you get here. But I will say this. Like I said before, remember, Gambia is a simpler life. If you're looking for the hustle and bustle, going out and partying, fashion shows, movie, a whole bunch of movie theaters, a whole bunch of malls, this is not it. Gambia is simpler. I mean, it's so simple. Look, the cows are even free. Yeah. Simpler way of life. If you're looking for a simpler way of life, you're retired, you just want to chill, this could be the spot for you. But I would say, let's talk about health care. Let's talk about, you know, your medical situations. Let's talk about those things first. So I will have it out on my, on my website down below. And let's talk about these things. But y'all see what's going on in America. America has lost its damn mind. For real. Especially when it comes to children. Because like my sister, who was a teacher, she got out of being a teacher in Florida. She said it was just too much. 
It was just too much. You got to be careful what pronoun you call somebody. You got to be careful. I mean, it was just too much. She said it was just too much. She got out. So, and because of that, with my sister, I got another project I'm working. And I'll let you all know about it. And I hope you'll visit the websites. As y'all can see, I do websites. So, <laughs> I do a lot of websites. So, yeah. Okay, y'all. Oh, yeah, we got to talk about this rain. Ooh. Okay, y'all. I'll see you all on my next one. Fatima out. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and share. If you're not a subscriber, click the subscribe button so that way you could be notified of our upcoming videos.